Hello and welcome to Case of the Day. I'm Dr. Crowley and today we're going to discuss a patient who came in the office. Uh, this was a young gentleman in his early 30s who was complaining of uh, intermittent portions of his vision being missing or he's having blank spots in his vision uh, and uh, he had some slight amount of blurred vision. So when we checked his vision, his vision was about 20-30 in each eye. Uh, so it wasn't that reduced. Uh, but then we uh, dilated his eyes and while we were dilating his eyes, we did a visual field test which showed an enlarged blind spot on his visual field. So what that means is, is that the optic nerve in the back of your eye Obviously, there's no retinal tissue or rods and cones for vision, so we can, when we do a visual field test, there's a, there's a dark spot or blank spot where there's no vision. Even though your brain smooths that out and you don't see it, it's something that we can, and when we test, we can actually find that. In this case, the, the little dark spot or blank spot in the vision was very large compared to what it would normally be. Uh, and also, when I looked inside his eye, he had what is called papilledema, or he had swelling of his optic nerve. And so the initial thought that I had was that this person had pseudotumor cerebri. And basically what pseudotumor cerebri is, is that there's an increase of intracranial pressure, or some another term for uh, pseudotumor cerebri is uh, idiopathic intracranial hypertension, that is the pressure inside the brain is elevated. And that elevation then is obvious when you look inside someone's eye because the optic nerve is a direct extension of the brain and you can see the swelling from the pressure in that optic nerve. And so uh, that's what this young man had. Uh, and uh, pseudotumor cerebri is uh, more common in women of childbearing age and more common in women who are obese. Symptoms can include headaches, severe nausea, vomiting. Um, you could have loss of side vision, intermittent, actually intermittent total loss of vision that lasts for seconds. Uh, in his case, he had pieces of his vision he was noticing that was missing at times. And uh, you could have uh, uh, dizziness and, and other things related to increased intracranial pressure. Um, it turns out that we referred this person to the neurologist and they had an MRI and it turns out he did not have pseudotumor cerebri but he actually did have a tumor in his frontal lobe. I don't know what type it was yet and I have not gotten a report back and he was referred to neurosurgery but anyway, the, the classically, he had the symptoms of pseudotumor cerebri. So if uh, you have sudden loss of vision totally, it lasts for seconds, headaches, nausea, vomiting, dizziness, and things along that line, uh, then you need to see your eye doctor immediately. Uh, like I said, this is the most common group of people who get this by far are women of childbearing age who are uh, overweight. So um, the treatments for that uh, a lot of times are Diamox and steroids and different things to um, as far as medically goes if that doesn't work then eventually maybe uh, surgery to release the pressure in the brain. So if you have any questions about that or anything else uh, we'll be happy to try and answer those. Uh, if not may God bless you with healthy eyes and great vision.